Morning, Commissioner, and obviously welcome uh, increased subsidiarity. Inevitably, you talked about climate change, and you're right. Uh, if you talk to a genuine climate scientist, they will tell you we're about to enter something called the Morden Minimum or the Dalton Minimum period. It is a solar cycle. It last happened about 150 years ago. The River Thames froze solid. This is, we will be in the grip of this in about 10 years' time. We need to adapt. That means we need to up our plant breeding effort to uh, counter this colder weather. That means embracing GM technology and gene editing, something that uh, apparently you won't do. Uh, you mentioned water saving. Yes, very, very worthy. Uh, and alfalfa is mentioned in your document here. I grow this. We call it lucerne in Britain. It is very drought resistant, but it is leguminous. It emit, emits nitrous oxide, a greenhouse gas that you don't like. You talk about permanent grassland. We want more of that. Fine. Uh, but remember, it will contain clover, which will emit nitrous oxide, a greenhouse gas that you don't want. Even if you do uh, increase your grassland, you can do this by upping the output of the arable crop, so they, they become more efficient. But in order to do that, you need the new plant breeding techniques. What are you going to do with this increased area of grassland? Put on ruminants? No, because they're going to emit methane. So we're going to see mass unemployment. Thank you. Mr. Agnew, there will be elves to the permanent grassland, but you, you, didn't, uh, uh, you didn't congratulate me on abolishing the three-crop rule, which was a big issue up in the UK, you know, and probably cost us a few votes in the referendum up in Brexit, but now, now we, well, we learn from that, you know, we learn from that. Uh, but the permanent grassland issue is going to be a, a, a quite a sensitive issue because we have case law now in recent times taken by a German farmer to the European Court of Justice, which we have to look at as well. But we did make some changes in the, in the omnibus regulation that reflected your concerns on this, and... Uh, I, think, I expect that this will be a major debate when we come to the, the detail of the legislation.